What's up everybody, 915 Mang here doing a video today. As you can see, I got a bunch of little, little uh, frags right here. Picked these frags up for a hammer on Reef to Reef. This is my first time actually ordering from somebody else on Reef to Reef. I usually just order from, uh, you know, credible websites who sell coral. But uh, this guy had a bunch of uh, frags that I liked. All in all, I picked up 12 frags. And then he ended up throwing in two extra frags of Zoas. This is a complete Zoa order. When I got these Zoas, they were uh, sent on the little frags right there, frag plugs. I just ended up breaking the stems and super glued them onto some discs. Uh, these are pretty nice Zoas. And I just hope they grow out and cover this whole disc. And that way I can just have a whole little colony of them. Uh, some of the Zoas that I picked up are. Uh, Picked up Jason Fox Fairy Tales. I got a thing of Darth Mauls. Um, I was really looking all over the place for Clementine Zoas. I know they're they're basic and um, been out for a long time, but that's what I really wanted, the Clementines. Um, I really couldn't find them local here. And uh, me being a Zoe guy, you know, I wanted those Clementines. I also saw some cool Zoas called uh, Gatorades, which these aren't. And... Uh, I also got uh, some Sonic Flares, Promantheans, some UFOs, uh, also got some Space Monsters, all kinds, I, you know, of different Zoas. If you're like me, you probably don't know half the names of them, but uh, the last four that I got was KH Sunburst, some uh, VW Bloods, those vampires. They're pretty cool, the, all the uh, moderations of the vampires. Um, Twizzlers. Blue Rhino Morphs, and he ended up throwing in, in two extra frags, um, which I didn't know he was going to do, but hey, I'm not going to complain. I really appreciate it. Um, but uh, you can see the Gatorade in the back, and uh, I just want to get a whole bunch of uh, different Zoas and just grow them out and because, you know, they're like, uh, they're real addicting, all the different colors that they come with, and, you know, they're most of them are pretty easy to care care for as you can see my sand bed is actually bare bottom I decided not to put any uh, sand into the tank but I am gonna go ahead and cover the whole floor with uh, frags this is the whole front of my tank and I still got plenty of room on the sides to uh, go ahead and cover them up with frags um, there's some cool people on Instagram uh, mainly this one guy from uh, Japan and he has a tank just full of Zoas, no aquascape at all, and uh, it's just full of Zoas. Um, ultimately, that would be sweet to get there, but uh, the bottom, what I want to do is keep all Zoas, and then on the top, I'll start messing around with acros or SPS, things like that. But uh, for me, it's all about the Zoas. Like I said, this was the first time ordering from uh, A Hammer. And uh, so I was a little bit uh, weary about that, but I did pay through uh, PayPal. Um, I figured that if I didn't uh, get what I wanted, I could always dispute it through PayPal and uh, go from there. Usually between reefers and on forums, that's how a lot of people sell their stuff through equipment, corals, etc., things like that. Um, but it was a pretty pleasant uh, experience. One thing that I want to bring up is communication. If you communicate with somebody, shoot them a message, and they don't respond back to you, just go ahead and end it right there. There's no need to end getting into a uh, big old headache over some corals, especially when you're dealing with money. So this guy had excellent uh, communication skills. I shot him a message. Within five minutes, he would reply back. I shot him another message asking for more questions. You know, same thing, five minutes or less, he would respond back. Once I sent him the payment, you know, he said, hey, I received it, and I'll check the weather. And uh, he sent, asked me what day I wanted it, and I told him, and uh, everything went good. So here's a little closer look at the <laughs> Zoe. <laughs> 